Hi everyone. It is Tuesday. I feel sick. I've not had any anti nausea tablets today. Or did I? I don't know. Because I'm about to pick some up. I've had one. Like, you're only meant to have them eight hours apart. So I don't know if I've had one or not, which is scary because if I have another one, what will it do to me? Because it tells you to have them eight hours apart. Um, I've just been with my doctor. I hate morning appointments. She was weird. She was really weird today. Um, she's made me question her because I said something to her because I thought something. And she's like, oh no, that's not true. And then said something else which contradicted herself. I don't know what to think. Um, I've edited last vlog, week's vlog already. I've not saved it because I wanted to see what happened today before I get, like fin finalised it because there might have been something I wanted to take out. It's nothing like life changing or anything like that. It was just, I was over overly emotional and very down last week. Um, so, got two hours before I need to be somewhere. Feels weird because I know I have to be somewhere at a certain time. But I keep thinking I've got the time wrong, but I know I haven't got the time wrong. There's just something in my brain isn't connecting today. I've made an effort with my outfit. I still have jeans on, but I have wedges on, my wedges. Oh God, my doctor had old lady shoes on today. <laughs> She's normally really well dressed and I saw her shoes, I'm thinking. Oh God, my arm's killing as well. Not very well, very down. Can't be asked. minutes because when I got here went on Instagram and found out Ravana was doing a restock and someone had posted 20 minutes earlier about it and I thought I'm gonna go on and everything sold out and I went on and I think I put six bath bombs in my basket or my cart as the cold on there and only one had sold out by the time I got to the checkout but the funny thing is, the one that had sold out, I've already got two of at home because I've been through my collection today. Um, and I had two of it. And I had one of one that I've just bought and I wanted a replacement for it so I can use it. Um, and then I've got three that I've never had before, which I'm happy about. I rushed through it as quickly as I could. I knew I didn't want any bath brittle because I've got one opened two unopened and three new ones that have just come so I've just got um, one of the bath bombs I weren't sure about and it's the one that always takes the longest to sell out when she does the restocks so I wasn't sure but I thought I'll give it a go we'll see I guess saved me £3.50 one minus 10% 35p so it saved me one um, three pound fifteen by not being able to get that other one, but I was like panicking, and because I'm not at home, the signal's weaker, so it's taking ages for the pages to load. And I got to the checkout, and straight away it said the coconut butter bowl's out of stock, but everything else was still there. Then I had to log in, and then I had to um, put my ten percent discount code in. And I'm thinking, God, all this time it means I'm going to end up with no products and I'm going to go back on the website and panic buy and then maybe other stuff's going to go like always because I always get caught up in it and I decided I only wanted to get certain things I wanted to get a boss babe which I've got I wanted to get a floral slumber which I got 
I went to get the strawberries and cream, which is my favourite, and I've got one at home, and now I can use that. And... What else did I... Um... Boss Babes Floral Slumber, strawberries and cream. I picked up vanilla latte. And what is the fifth one? Floral Slumber. Boss Babe, strawberries and cream, vanilla latte, latte, Oh, what I have got, not what I've not got. I almost got raspberry butter bowl, but I think I've got one left. And it's not my favourite. Like, I like it, but I, I would have preferred if it was strawberry butter bowl. She's got a new one called Marshmallow, because she's from Marlow. Um, I didn't want that. I can't remember what the fifth one is, because I know I've got five for once. I probably had time to other, put other stuff in, but I can't keep buying them. I've got two coconut butter balls. I've got a strawberries and cream, a raspberry one, an unopened raspberry one that I'm going to give to someone, um, a post gym, which came yesterday, a black beauty, two packs of black beauty bath brittle, an open pack of hangover bath brittle, Three packs of jelly bath brittle that came yesterday. I'm going to give one away. Um, is that everything I've got? I've got a candle coming from Lavana, which I ordered a couple of weeks ago. Um, I'm going to check what that bath bomb is. The bath bomb is called Honeydew. Um, don't know what's in it. Um, I think I've checked at some point in the past. But I just grabbed it on the way through when I was going down the list because I think she's got five pages of products now and I added it because I added extra just in case when I got to check out there was something missing and the coconut one was missing and it is my favourite because of the scent and because of how nice it feels so I'm at the shop I'm about to go in it has started raining again I want a trolley and yeah I know I've not filmed for a few days, I don't think I've filmed much. A lot has happened this week. I've not been in a good place mentally. Um, I'm not going to get into everything here now, I'll try and film later. Yesterday's video went up late, um, but it went up It went up on the day. I still need to fill the description box in. But I'll try and update you, I'll try and get a decent video out. I need to go shopping. one is done I feel like I'm getting a cold which is normally how my illness starts I'm all an achy and I've had a temperature all day and I'm hoping it's not that <sighs> um, I'm just about to put the heating on my feet even though I've got a temperature in my face my body's cold so I picked this up I think it's a um, tomato and basil flatbread and garlic I think Not basil, pesto. And I've got my new favourite drink. I straightened my hair before I come out. Let's come here a second as well. But I wanted to get cash out, which I should have done yesterday, but I forgot. Um, because Yesterday from here, and I know I didn't film my food shopping, um, something stressful happened, um, so I didn't show you what I got. But I bought these ice cream lollies called Knobbly Bobblies, 
and there's someone on Instagram called Rosie who buys two boxes a day and eats a full box in a go. I've literally eaten a full box since yesterday. I had one about an hour after I got home, one in the evening, one at three or four in the morning and one at lunchtime. So, because we're on offer here, I wanted to get a couple of boxes for the weekend. So if I remember and I'm not too tired and I've got some money left, I'm going to come here before I go home, if I remember. 50, 192, 96, no, 90, 94, because I put another 4p in so I'd got 10p change. And I didn't get the bulk of the shopping here. The bulk of the shopping needs to be bought at Aldi. My dad sent me a list again. Do you know pine nuts are £3.50 for a small pack, but he wants some pine nuts. Max and he wants salmon and chicken. Um, pears, I got pears here. Because we're not for a pound of packs, so we're getting two packs. Porridge pots. Wants tomatoes, sun dried tomatoes, um, other stuff, I don't know. It's on my phone, so I can't tell you. I'm not feeling very well and I'm annoyed. This is quite salty. I'm gonna leave that. I hate that I don't feel well. Um, I've had a temperature all day and I thought, should I ring the doctors today? And I didn't want to, because I've been the... Tuesday morning, Wednesday triage, um, but I didn't get an appointment. I went in Wednesday twice and I went yesterday. basically the only day I missed was Monday and I didn't want to ring and I know my doctor wasn't in today but to be honest I've, I don't want her that tells you something doesn't it so how did I got some Spanish olives with lemon and herb I don't like olives so you can probably guess they're not for me Brown ripened tomatoes, more olives marinated with chilli and garlic, some tender stem broccoli, two packs of these sweet mini peppers, hopefully I'll get some of these this week. Um, this is one of the coffees I get, it's cheap, it's one fifty nine, and it's not bad. Um, I've had better and I've had worse, but they'll do. Strawberries from Scotland, or Scottish strawberries, apple crisps. Never had them before, but I'm gonna give them a go. Two boxes of the Cathedral City Baked Bites for my dad. Kinder Brain all for me. Pink Clay Hot Cloth Cleanser. I keep seeing this, so I thought I would try it this week. More apple crisps. These are to die for. They're for my dad, but I'll probably have a couple out of it. Marinated tomatoes with garlic and oregano. Got one of these from from Asda the other week and I've only used one of the discs and I keep seeing these so I thought I might as well get another one ready. Two packs of these long matches and even one of the matches, look at the size of them. These are nice as well, stuffed cherry peppers with ricotta, extra virgin olive oil hummus, I got some flatbread from Tesco and I thought why not, I've not had anything like this for ages, I've not tried Aldi's hummus but it's new, so we'll see if it's any good. Soft bombs. Hickory barbecue mini pork sausages for next week for me. Salted caramel. I did try and get the chocolate ones, but they only had salted caramel ones in. Love and bacon for my dad for one of his lunches next week. A medium pack of chicken breast fillets for my dad. Count and sweet mash. Normal mash. Um, dark thunder energy drink. Caribou. Carabay, Carabao, Green Apple, I like that, I've had one of them today already. Grayson's Gin and Tonic. Two more of the energy drinks. Cider vinegar to use in my hair, believe it or not. Pop shoulder joint, normally I wouldn't get pork, I don't really eat red meat. Um, 
maybe once a week, once a fortnight maximum. It doesn't agree with me. I tried to get um, a beef joint or a chicken joint. There wasn't anything left on the shelf, so this is probably less than half the price I would have paid for a beef joint. So, God, it's got the date on for Sunday. That's not a good date. Um, some chili and lime chicken kebabs for me for next week. Some salmon fillets. Some blue lilies. <coughs> <sighs> and I don't feel very well. I'm getting all snotty and cold. Like when you get a cold, that normally means I'm getting my illness is flaring up, which is just amazing. Um, yeah. I've still got that to unpack. Let's get this in the fridge. Oh god. Why did I not check the fridge before I went out? So I have got the Aldi shopping away, but I don't know where the Tesco shop is going to go, but I need to clean up all the mess on here. Um, trying to hide names and stuff, but it's full of tablets and pots of paint and drinks. So I'm, I think that's my weekend job as long as I don't get sick because I'm not feeling great. I've got a juice. Two more of these. I think I've got one or two in the fridge. I didn't want to get a lot. These are the multigrain and rye rolled flat 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 Okay, I speak flatbreads that I got before I got the hummus, so, you know, snacky snack. They are what I use to wipe my hands when I'm doing my makeup, and I've not had any for a week or two, and I've been using other wipes that I don't love. Um, by that I mean I don't really want them, well I don't mind them on my face, but I prefer other ones, so, these are 40p. Tesco Finest, Basil Pesto and Tomato Hand Stretch Flat flatbread you would have seen me eat something similar in my car and waste it in fact i've left it in my car i keep doing that tesco finest wiltshire cured ham it was on offer for two pound mccain shake shake fries and smoked paprika on offer for a pound spaghetti and meatballs for my dad for one day for a meal at the work next week victoria seedless grapes pine nuts three pound fifty for them my dad wanted them i hope he don't use a pack a week I've seen them all, new with them. My favourite, favourite yoghurt, 60 peach at the moment. I've just finished one of these. I try and get one of them on offer. It was on offer for 150, I think. I also use the facial scrub as well, and that's I've got about one use left, but it weren't on offer, so I didn't get that. It's what I use on my face in the shower in the morning, either this or the scrub, or sometimes both together. I've got two cards, I've got this one and that one. Um they're for gifts for people, not birthday presents, just like, thank you for being amazing. Um, the for people that, um, just, well, you don't need to know because I'm not giving my life away on the internet, so there you go. Um, I got this Gordon's Ultra Low Alcohol Gin and Tonic. Look at that, 5%. Um, I don't think I'm going to be well enough to have it, but I've got it and it's a cute bottle and it was on offer. I like an offer and I got the Tesco version. Um, I don't think I like normal gin and tonic, I like pink gin, but who cares? I know based on how I feel now, there's no chance they're going to be drunk. Then the sticks, bread rolls, um, what's that called? Pepsi Max Cherry. Oh, I've got my drink still in my car, I don't think I finished it. I'm going to go out and get it. A normal Pepsi Max. Two bags of confidence pears because my dad wanted them. They were enough for a pound, that's where I got two. Two bottles of Diet Coke, a 1.5 litre bottle of Pepsi Max, two 1.5 litre bottles of Alice Springs, another Pepsi Max, another Diet Coke, two Luke's Aids, and the milk I have in my coffee in the morning or whenever I have it. Toilet rolls. I've got to fit that in the fridge, everyone. Oh my god. Who wants to do that? I am going to struggle right about now. So I quickly had to go into B&M because in Aldi there was no porridge pots and my dad requested them. Still not managed to get any but I've got an alternative, not the gin. This is a gift. You would have just seen I've 
done some cards or bought some cards this is one of the things that's going to go in with one of the cards there's a lot of stuff going in but this is like a little extra thing um there's a bottle of gordon's premium pink gin edgerton's original pink gin and the lakes rhubarb and rose hip gin liqueur i want a pack of this mm, i don't really drink but that was 6 99 in case anyone wants to know i love these noodles um probably have this for lunch one day next week they're only a pound this is the porridge I got. I was going to buy it in Audi because Audi have these and I thought I'll go over to B&M and see if there's any porridge pots and I'm in there either so it's from my dad. Um, he just needs some milk. He's got a fridge. I bought him a fridge like last year so he's just going to have to make his own. It's not hard to do. Um, I got another gin. Um, probably not going to drink it. I think it's like 89p. It was weird. You notice how the nail polish always stays on my phone, but never on my fingers. Um, have I said that about that? I want to put that in the freezer because I want it. Custard for Sunday. That is all. Goodbye. <laughs> but honestly, I've had enough. I'm tired. Look how you sat. It's because you squeezed on, didn't you? No, I didn't. Because that bloody granddad was sat here and he was taking my space so I squeezed my little bum on. Yes, I did. Hey, chinkster. I don't want to be on camera. Everyone, I know you can't see me. Pretty obvious what I am. I'm in the bath with a um, House of Ashes bath milk infusion. I'm struggling to stay awake. You're struggling. These milk bath infusions are so relaxing. It wasn't the best idea to use it because I was falling asleep downstairs and I'm like, I'm gonna slide down, I'm gonna go to bed, I can't stay awake. And then I got moving a little bit and I thought I need to have my bath because I planned a bath for today. I could have had it yesterday and I'm sorry about my voice, it's been like this since I've got up. It wasn't as bad. Um, as it was this morning, but it's time to go back that way now. I started talking. Um, so I thought I want my bath, I've planned my bath. I'm not going to get a chance to have one tomorrow. So, you know, most people would go and like have a sleep for a few hours and then have the bath, but the problem is then my dad will be home and he'll be drunk and he'll just come in the or well, you'll try and come in the bathroom, so I don't have baths when he's at home. So I thought I'll have a bath and I got in and I am fighting sleep, my eyes keep closing and I feel like I'm having, do you know when you like fall asleep and wake up a few seconds later, I think that's happening. Um, I am let down but I'm a little bit propped up in the way I'm led if that makes sense. But I'm really fighting it and is not fair or right, I guess, that I'm fighting it when the reason I got in this bath and used this particular product was to relax because it's the one thing that gets me super relaxed and chilled out and it even makes me put my phone down and makes me not want to sit and scroll in the bath like I always do. But I'm fighting sleep like I'm struggling to keep my eyes open trying to film this. It's an absolute nightmare. I'm gonna have to go and get in bed. My bedding's in the washer. I'm gonna fall asleep and end up like trying my bed in at like midnight or something. I don't know. And um, I thought I'll go like on my bed and put my cover on me. 
and then when I wake up wash my hair then but the problem is I've got a face mask on that's very tight to my forehead and is annoying me so I'm gonna have to have a shower and have what hair whatever my hair is wet anyway because I've got it in the bath a little bit even though it's up so that's where we are I feel like this milk infusion's kind of gone to waste a little bit because I've not been able to enjoy it, I've not been able to relax like I want to do because I can't keep my eyes open and I'm going to end up falling asleep and there's times when I, it would bother me if I fell asleep in the bath because you know how I feel and stuff but my eyes are like rolling in the back of my head like it's not, it's not good at all so unfortunately I'm going to have to get out and go and have a shower um, yeah, but I thought I'd just finish the video here. I'm not going to be able to film anything else. This is going to be the end of the video. It's just been one of those weeks. I've not really wanted to film anything. I've not been very well. And I do try and film when I'm ill. But, yeah. But hopefully I'll be back next week. Hopefully it'll be better. Who knows? Who knows what's going to happen? Um, yeah. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Still desperate to get to a thousand. I mean... I'm going to be happy when I get to 300, but obviously a thousand would be amazing. So if you are not subscribed, please subscribe and don't forget to click the bell notification button to get an alert every time I upload a video. I'll be back in a week's time with another weekly vlog, hopefully, and I don't know if I've got anything else coming up between now and then because of how and well I feel, but we'll see. And thank you for watching. Bye everyone.